This problem is about using area to compute a definite integral. The graph of f is given below, and it consists of only straight line segments. Compute the integral from negative 2 to 5 of f of x dx. There are two ways to compute this definite integral. The first way is algebraically using anti-differentiation. To do this, we would need to go write a formula for each of the line segments that make up the graph of f. That would be a lot of work, and so it's not a very good idea. Let's talk about the second way. The second way to compute this definite integral is to use its representation as the signed area between the graph and the x-axis. We can use additional information from the picture, namely, the function f is always greater than or equal to zero. Therefore, the signed area will always be positive, so we are simply looking for the area under the graph. Let's go break up the area under the graph into smaller pieces. We can easily draw it using rectangles and triangles. There are four natural pieces to the area we need to compute. Let's write down the area for each piece separately, then we can add them all up. The first area is 1 half times 2 times 2. The second area is 2 times 2. The third area is 1 half times 3 times 1. And the fourth area is 3 times 1. Let's add all these up to get our final answer. The final answer is the integral is equal to the area, which is equal to 21 halves. This problem was a classic example of using area to compute a definite integral.